Have you ever dreamt about becoming an artist? Well, thanks to the latest groundbreaking AI technologies, now anyone can be a creator. So today, we'll talk about the evolution of one of the most famous AI image generator solutions, DALL-E. The Jelvix Creative Department kept a close eye on its functionality improvements and is ready to share the most important takeaways. We'll put its two versions side by side, DALL-E 2 and DALL-E 3, to explore its key differences, improvements, and capabilities. We're Jelvix, a software development partner for industry leaders. We post weekly videos on tech in five minutes. Don't forget to subscribe to discover more insight-packed content. Also, use the Super Thanks feature to support our channel. And make sure to watch till the end to explore best practices on effective prompts creation for next-level AI-powered images. Let's start with the basics. DALL-E is a text-to-image diffusion model created by OpenAI that can generate realistic images from text descriptions and edit or generate variations of existing images. DALL-E was first introduced in January 2021, and since its onset, the solution has made a real breakthrough in many aspects, including image quality, text understanding, and versatility. And while only six months separate DALL-E 2 from DALL-E 3, the upgrades brought to DALL-E 3 are imminent. No wonder Jelvix designer Alex says, it's all because of a much wider data set of parameters DALL-E 3 has been trained on. As OpenAI claims, quote, DALL-E 3 understands significantly more nuances than our previous systems, allowing you to easily translate your ideas into exceptionally accurate images. Now, don't take Jelvix's word for it. Take a look at the actual images generated in these two versions. As you can see from it, DALL-E 3 did a spectacular job getting the proportions of various elements and combining them all within the image. The level of detail of the background, the shadows on the dog's spacesuit, and even the folds on the cat's t-shirts were considered. By the way, resolution also plays a significant role on the overall image quality. And as the Jelvix team observed, DALL-E 3 generates images at resolution almost twice as big compared to DALL-E 2, hence the greater attention to detail. Talking about level of detail, DALL-E 3 is claimed to have a better understanding of more complex concepts and to pick them in a natural way. Take a look at this picture generated by Jim Clyde Monk. Which one conveys the emotions and provides us with a better understanding of the close nature of the relationship between the girl and the cat? And let's take a look at another image, generated from a prompt by Fabian Moselli, a still of Mike Wazowski live streaming tutorials for his influencer channel from the 2018 live action reboot. Again, the conveyance of emotions and context in Dolly 3 are unparalleled to its predecessor. Well, but why do we see such a striking difference between Dolly 2 and Dolly 3? Jelvix is confident it lies at the core of the solution's technologies themselves. Dolly 2 uses a diffusion model conditioned on clip image embeddings, which can produce realistic and diverse images. Diffusion model is the image generation approach that works by iteratively adding noise to a clean image until it is completely obscured and then reverses this process by gradually removing noise from the obscured image until a new, clean image is created. The diffusion model architecture of DALL-E 3 is not yet publicly known. However, based on the Jelvix understanding of diffusion models combined with the capabilities of DALL-E 3, it's likely its diffusion model is way more advanced. DALL-E 3 also performs better in the text integration within the image, being able to adjust the text to the overall image style and integrate it organically. Oh, and didn't we forget to mention, a game-changing feature of DALL-E 3 is its integration with ChatGPT, which enables it to refine prompts easily and streamline the creative process overall. DALL-E 3 is also expected to better tackle the authenticity issue. Unlike DALL-E 2, who used to copy modern artistic styles, DALL-E 3 is aimed to avoid applying styles of the living artists to respect their artwork ownership. The next DALL-E version promises to go even further and block results resembling a specific artist. Besides, artists can request to remove their images from future queries by claiming their rights. That's cool, isn't it? Now, these are just a few examples of the potential improvements to the diffusion model in DALL-E 3. It's still early days for the technology, but the future of text-to-image generation looks very promising. However, if you'd like to try out DALL-E 3, the Jelvix team might disappoint you by saying that it's not yet available to the wide public. But keep your chin up. We're confident OpenAI won't keep us waiting much longer. And as promised, Here's the list of some of the best practices you can apply during image creation. Meanwhile, you can check out another video on Midjourney versus Leonardo. Also, support us by liking this video and leaving a comment. And don't forget to subscribe and press the bell button. Bye for now.